Hey writers, and welcome to your first writing prompt. I hope you've been staying safe and well throughout this entire thing. And though I know times like these can be really challenging for a lot of us, it's important to sort of take the silver linings where we can and turn these sorts of moments of negativity into moments of inspiration and you know blessings that we can find throughout the day, even when it's really hard to find those, right? So today, I want to focus on meaning, and more specifically, meaning that's personal to you. Think about an object in your life that has meaning to you that not everybody would know about. It can be either a sentimental object, it can be a gift that somebody has given to you, it can be something that you've made yourself, it can be a variety of different things. But it needs to be something that is meaningful to you, and especially meaningful to you, but maybe not so obvious to everybody else, right? So, to start, I want to give an example for myself. I have here this vial of sand that I brought back from California. If anybody were to see this, it literally is just a vial of sand. It's nothing special. You would probably just throw it away, not even think about it, right? So why is it meaningful to me? Well, when I got this, I was visiting California for the first time, and it was the first time I had traveled out of state. I flew there, so it was the first time I had been on a plane, and it was also really the first time that I had been away from home, because I went by myself on the flight to meet up with family who was also in California. But as a result, I was in kind of an environment where, you know, I didn't know a lot of, of people. I didn't really know anybody, as a matter of fact. I didn't really know a lot of what I was doing. It was my first time, right? And so I was kind of anxious throughout the entire trip, to be honest. But one of the things that kind of calmed me down and brought me peace was when we would go on walks, and more specifically, walks on the beach out there, which is beautiful, by the way. But when we were out there, um, one thing that really struck me was just the smell of the environment. Just like the smell of the water kind of coming in off the wave, the smell of the sand, the smell of the beach, the smell of the air, kind of, you know, getting that fresh sort of air coming in. And so I had a little film canister with me, and I put a little vial of sand in here, and I brought it home with me. And I kid you not, every time I open this, although I have to be careful not to open it too much, I can still smell that smell that I smelled all the way in California and it can bring me peace sometimes when I might be a little bit anxious. So this object has meaning to me but it doesn't necessarily have meaning to anybody else. So what's an object like that in your life? Or maybe if you don't want to talk about yourself as much, what's an object like that that would be in one of your characters lives? Either in one that you've written or in one that you've yet to write and are about to write. I want you to write a little bit about that, tell me a little bit about that, and tell me why it has such a meaning to you or the character. I look forward to seeing what you had to say, I look forward to seeing you next time, and I can't wait to give you feedback on the paint that you've written. Have a great day, have fun writing, and I'll see you in the next one.